うせ戯れよ耳を貸す必要はないぼ僕はい姉さんはそれでいいの Beatrice couldn't hide her evil smile at those words. Yep. Bokwa yada. Shiaose naritai kagna de mo yada. Ningen ninate. Okumo nesa no yoni. Umiga aoi te koto shi ditai na. Come on, my man. Like I said, I get it. Bokwa yi desu. Ura yamashi. Da kara wakamono wa suki na no da. Whoa, he's in there, Beatrice. Genji, Shannon wa sagare. Kanon, Lucifer wa mae. オセのままに。気に入らないわ。ベアトリーチ様は無理でも。私にだったら勝てるかもしれないという見下しが最高に気に入らないわ。That was probably humiliating for Lucifer. But at the same time, she was also happy that she was lucky enough to have this adorable prey all to herself. Oh shit. Oh. She's got the pulsating energy sword. Nice. Yeah. Make her sweat a little bit, Canon. Make her work for it. <laughs> yeah, he's like, look at that. My energy sword pulsates too, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, explain this without magic, Batora. <laughs> nah, nothing's weird, all right? Beatrice invites some guests over. They whipped out some energy swords, all right? It's, it's just Halo, alright? <laughs> nah, it's not a magic battle. She challenged him to some 1v1 Halo Online energy swords only, alright? そなたがどんなに笑わや魔法の存在を否定しようとも。ほらほら、ほらほら、こうして目の前でブワンブワンカキンカキンやられちゃ。ほらほら、ほらほら、もう思考なんて止めちまえ。魔法はあるんだって。
私なんか眼中にないというのね<笑>気に入らないわ威風を感じないその目本当に気に入らないわカノン君あやつサタンの敵よりも筋がいいではないか<笑>だから人間は恐ろたまに魔女にまでなり悪魔を執事扱いにしたりいたしますよ<笑><笑>わらわはどちらを応援すればよいというのこいつ私と互角に渡り合うというのえ僕を見くびお前にそのおごりがある限り僕にはけな私がこの煉獄の七姉妹が長女ルシファーを刺して消したこ,こんな思い上がりがイエーマボーイカバーンイエスイエスカノン was desperately trying to stay alive and he had a strong desire to become human but Lucifer didn't feel anything stronger than a slight desire to play so that led to an inevitable result It was a result that could be reached by the power of humans. The power of the heart. The glowing red curve extended straight out from Kanon's arm, pointing at Lucifer's throat just beneath the tip of her chin. As she ground her teeth in irritation, she tried to deny the truth right before her eyes. No matter how much she believed in her own superiority, it didn't change the facts right in front of her. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> It seemed like mere rebuke to an outsider. However, furniture serving the witch knew what kind of severe treatment was promised by that rebuke. Understood what had been left unsaid. <laughs> She howled. Abandoning her last bit of pride, she made her body explode, exposing her true form. That form was a demon stake which bounced off the walls surrounding the room. <laughs> did Shannon do what Jessica did last time? After flying about wildly for some time, with speed approaching the limits of what a human eye could follow, Lucifer flew at Kanon's heart. She could tell that it was Kanon's blood by the sweet taste of it. But she quickly noticed one thing Shen pierced his heart. <laughs> The floor is stained with dripping blood. Did he catch it? It really was Cannon's blood, but it was like from his hand, right? But it wasn't flowing out of his chest. Cannon sacrificed his own left hand! Yes! Yes, I fucking knew it. <laughs> Lucifer was arrogant. Even though she'd been given enough time to realize that this was an opponent capable of courting her, in her pride she'd believed him to be worthless. She'd gotten careless. Yes. So just as she had announced, she had aimed for his chest, trying to pierce his heart. 
because she was arrogant. She hadn't even thought of aiming for somewhere other than the place she'd announced. No, maybe she had thought about it a little. However, her pride would not allow her to aim for a different spot. After all, she was... Lucifer of Pride. Kanon was standing the pain, grasped the demon stake sticking into his left hand strongly with his right hand, and pulled it out. When she heard the sound of breaking bones and more blood dripping down, Shun looked away reflexively. There was an air hole in the back of the ha pierced hand so big you could clearly see through to the other side. Yeesh. Kanon's face was filled with pain, but right now, he had won without a doubt. The demon stake he was gripping with his right hand turned back into Lucifer again, so that Kanon was now gripping exactly where her neck was. Yes! <laughs> Kanon didn't hold back with all, at all with the hand gripping Lucifer's throat. Good. She had challenged him again after the fight had already been decided. Kanon had no obligation to be considerate. Yes! But even so, Kanon released the witch's furniture. Was it his naive humanism, his pity for another furniture, or a final bit of disrespect to the witch? In any case, when she was released, Lucifer fell face down on the ground, retching and moaning over the pain in her throat. Ernave was clapping his hands. To Kanon, who had won at great cost and had a wound on his left hand that wouldn't close, Ernave's applause only felt like mockery. <laughs> Sean ran up to him and wrapped a handkerchief around his left hand, which was spray still spraying blood. みんな押した。正直みんな押したぞ。おいえ。約束を忘れてはいないだろうな。ベアトリッチ。もちろん忘れてマジョも悪魔もひどく流しかし。契約に限っては人間など及ばぬほどに高潔だ。わらわは保護
I feel like I totally would have picked up on that. No way. No way. I'd watch back this recording, but you know, it's still recording, which means I can't watch it back, and there's no way I'm scrolling that far back up in the backlog. God damn. Ugh. There's not like a regular backlog to this, is there? Oh, there, there is. Nope, it's just the one where you scroll up in it's text box. <sighs> Damn it. This game needs a better backlog. <sighs> God, did you really phrase it like that? I don't fucking... I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Believe it! This is some bullshit. I said I'd give you your reward if you could defeat my furniture. Like, obviously I should have expected some shit like this, but I feel like that what that's not how it was phrased. Oh, now it's gonna be a six on one. <laughs> I forget which one you are with the big fucking curly pigtails, but I don't like your hair. It looks stupid. I don't like Leviathan's hair either. It's too bright. doesn't fit the rest of them. The rest of them have like varying shades of brown to black. You know, and you got blondie, you got the golden blonde. You got the really light brown, almost white. You got the darker brown. You got the dark brown there with the, that, that one. Then you got Lucifer's all black, and then you got Leviathan's got this bright green hair. It's just like, ew. But yeah, curls over there. I don't like your hair, it's too big. Everyone else has like the long flowing strands, you know, and then it's just like that one. It's it's like, yo, you poofy as hell, bitch. <sighs> the air split with shrill laughter, and as a golden splash scattered about, the remaining six sisters of Purgatory showed themselves. All the seven sisters of Purgatory were here, after Kano was able to defeat one only by sacrificing his left arm. But now Kano regretted his thoughtlessness in accepting the witch's challenge. Yeah, I... I I'm gonna have to watch that back, because I, I feel like that's total bullshit. He'd been foolish to assume that a game against a witch would be on even footing. That was also my fault, too. But I felt like... I feel like if I would have read that, I would have seen the loophole there. I feel like if I would have read that... I would have seen the loophole. I was too focused on him not being able to actually take out one of them. That apparently I missed a big loophole like that. I feel like I would have fucking noticed that loophole immediately. Yes, <laughs> だから<笑> above. Your hair is fucking stupid. でも、いい気にならないこと。ルシファーお姉様なんて威張ってるだけで姉妹のことじゃ大したことないんだから。だからルシファーは何もしなくていいといつも言っている。お姉様は威張ってだけいればいい。あらごとは全て優秀な私た
much to lose for a snap and just kill the rest of them. It's like, Kan's like, well, I guess I win. That'd be hilarious. Oh, Lucifer's rejoining the party and it's a seven on one. Great. ルーシファーをね、私たち妹の力が借りたいのよ。言ってよ。お姉様の口から助けを求める言葉が聞きたいの。私は苦しくて情けない。この女の子。You're Lucifer is a lot more attractive than you'll ever be, just because of the hair. I get it, you're all the exact same character, just with different hair, but that makes a huge difference. ねえ、聞かせてよ。それを聞かせてくれたら助けてあげる。みんな、お前たち、お、お乗れ。<laughs> Seven Sisters of Purgatory unanimously closed in on their worthless sister, abusing her. Even Kanon, who had been fighting for his life till a second ago, couldn't bear to look at it. Psst. <laughs> <laughs> after grinding her teeth over and over, after hearing her sister's curses, Lucifer trembled all over and answered her sister's request. Oh. <laughs> The girl known as Pride was finally unable to endure the words she was saying and broke down crying. However, the six younger sisters kept giggling cold cold heartedly. ちょっと泣いてごまかさないで。まだいつってない。もう十分だろう。さあ、姉妹たち。我らの力を見せてやろう。私は全部聞かなきゃ満足しないわよ。ほらほら、お姉様、続けてよ。もう十分。さあ、
This time they would genuinely follow their master's order. Take Kanon down. Swiftly and painlessly? 